Hey, what's going on everybody? I just wanted to make a little update video. I do apologize if the audio is a bit trash. I've tried to fix this problem on my phone for a while now, and for some reason it sounds fine on calls, it sounds fine on voice recorder, but as soon as I go to record a video, it just sounds like garbage. I've looked through all the settings in my Note 9. I don't know how to fix it. It's just being a piece of shit. So I apologize for the sound quality. It really triggers me too, because I'm an audiophile, and when there's shit sound quality, it really pisses me off. So I apologize for that. I'm in my work clothes too, by the way. I'm on lunch. So I just wanted to make this quick little video. I'm letting you guys know where I am, um, and uh, the last time that I spoke to you guys was in that video where I basically explained where the hell I actually was. Um, so yeah, you get to now see me live in the flesh, in, in glorious HD now, so you get to see my horrible teeth and my horrible face in glorious HD. Um, so I hope you enjoy the ride. It's not going to be a very long video, so you don't have to look at that shit too long. Um, but yeah, uh, it's going to be uh, very interesting um, going forward for TAR. Um, I do actually have some stuff in the works, like the, the, the N64 overview is being worked on right now, the project file is there, um, I, have so, I have a lot of the research done, I have a lot of the script written, or the, the, the rough draft written for the script. Um, so that's coming along very well, the, the, the video is going to take a little longer because I actually have quite a big announcement for the channel. Um, so I've been meaning to upgrade the uh, production quality and the production value of TAR for a very long time. And you've noticed progressively with the console overview videos, because those are the videos that I put the most effort into, um, that they've gotten better and better and better throughout the three that I've done. So the first one was pretty good. Second one was really good. Third one, which nobody has watched, unfortunately, I put even more production value into. Please go watch that video because YouTube fucked it, fucked me over with that one. Nothing I can do about it. So please go watch the PlayStation video if you would like. Um, I'm not forcing you to, but please because it only got like 500 views. It's really starting to piss me off. But that was like a year ago too I made that. But the other ones are like 15, 14, 13,000 views. So I don't know. But I'm going to be stepping it up even more for the N64 video and and going forth with the channel, going forward with the channel. Um, so I am actually going to be purchasing a Sony A7 III, which is an excellent camera, the excellent all-around stills and video camera. Um, that I'm going to be using for the channel. So I'm going to be using it for my photography business, and I'm also going to be using it for um, the, the YouTube channel. And another big announcement, um, and, and actually, let me, let, me, let me finish what I was saying. So the console overview on the N64 is going to take a little bit longer because of the fact that I have to buy this new camera, because it cost $1,800 without a lens. I want it with a lens, so I'm going to be paying a little bit over $2,000 for it. Right now, I'm sitting about 1000 you know, just, just under a thousand. So it's not going to take me that long if I just, if I'm a cheapskate for, you know, a month, I'll be able to get that, that camera probably no problem. Um, so within a month or so is probably when I'm really going to start cracking down on getting the footage because I'm not going to start recording, I'm not going to start recording footage yet for that video because I want it to all be nice. I want it to all look good. I want it to all be at that standard. Um, so it's going to be a little bit, but I do have some other videos planned. I'm not going to necessarily say what they are because I don't have a, a particular game plan, but I do have some videos planned. Um, talking about certain things that I've done on the channel before. I actually want to get a little bit into the Betamax stuff because I have a passion for that stuff. It doesn't get a lot of views, but God damn it if I'm not going to talk about it because I enjoy it. It's my channel. It literally says in the banner, channel or like videos about anything. I'm going to post videos about anything until I find my mojo and figure out what really holds with this channel. But for the time being, the console overview series is going to be the most high production thing on the channel. Um, and I do plan on making all my videos high production like that, especially with this new camera, because I'm going to get lights, I'm going to get a jib, I'm going to get a motorized slider, I'm going to get, like, panning heads and stuff like that. I'm going to get all kind of fancy stuff. Um, not only because I want to um, just have this stuff, but because I'm trying to build a business. Um, I'm trying to build a business not only out of my videos, because I, I YouTube is a lost cause. I'm not expecting to make money on YouTube. That's just not going to happen. Um, especially with, I'm going to say it, coronavirus covid 19 you know i'm gonna say all the trigger words i'm gonna say world health organization i'm gonna say china i'm gonna say xi jinping i'm gonna say i don't give a shit you can demonetize me i'm not doing it for the money because i know damn well i'm not gonna make money on this platform unless i get a sponsor spot or something like that which would be great but i don't expect that either um, but yeah, so new production value, like better production value, it's going to look a lot better, it's going to be a lot better, it's going to be awesome. I can't wait to show you guys how much better and how much more capable this is going to make me um, when it comes to producing videos, because the equipment that I have right now is more rudimentary. Um, I can't really do a lot of cool stuff that I've been wanting to do with the channel. Now with this a7 III, it's going to open up a lot. Like, it's, it's, it's going to open up a lot. And with all the equipment I'm going to get, it's going to be great. So that's one of the reasons why this video is going to take a little bit. Um, that's why it has taken a little bit, because I've, I have been doing the research. I have been working on the video periodically. Um, it's just that I want to get that camera before I start really digging into this video, because I want it to be 
that big project that everybody looks at goes, wow, like this channel is worth subscribing to. You know, I, I, I want to have that moment where people just go, you know, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I'm not guaranteeing that's going to happen. It, it probably won't. I mean, it's YouTube 2020, right? You know, what, 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 what would I expect? But I want to try at least. And if that doesn't work, I still have a nice freaking camera to work with, which I'm going to take with me to air shows so that, like I always do. I'm going to do all the same stuff I always do, only with a nicer camera. Um, and I'm going to do, for, like photography, I don't have to worry about YouTube ad revenue. So I, I can sell my photos as much as I want. I can do my photography business as much as I want. So that brings me on to the next, uh, I'll stop talking about that and I'll go on to my next announcement. We have a website now um, for Tar Media. So Tar Media, um, in case you didn't know, is actually a media production company that I am looking to run. Um, it's something that I've actually been wanting to do. A lot of people has, have asked me if I'm like really, really um, inspired by Linus Tech Tips. Yes, um, but I actually wanted to do this long before I ever even know who Linus was, long before he was ever posting on the LTT channel or any of that. I think he might have still been with NCIX at that time. I know he was working there, but um, I, I just wanted to mention this because I, I actually get a few people asking me this in person. Um, not so much online, but in person. Um, like, like, you trying to be LTT too? I'm like, no, not really. I've been trying to do a media production company for a long time. Like, ever since I was a little kid. I remember in, like, 2009, I had ideas written up. Like, oh, I'm going to do this and this and this and this. And I'm going to have this. And, you know, I'm going to make videos. And I'm going to have, like, a an editorial and, and all this shit. I'm going to have all this cool shit going on. And it never really happened. And now I kind of want to make it happen. Because it's something I've wanted to do ever since I was a kid. And uh, it's called Tar Media, and obviously named after Tar, which is a name that if you've watched one of my old videos, you know where Tar came from. I'm not going to explain it now because it's supposed to be a little bit of a shorter video, but um, I'm going to, yeah, start running Tar Media. I'm going to form form the business. I mean, it's already formed, but I'm going to I'm, I'm going to get this business going. I'm going to see where it goes. I don't expect it to be massively successful. It's just mostly there so that I have a way to protect all of the things that I do. Because I'm going to have it under an LLC, of course. And I, so I can protect all the assets that I have for the company. Uh, protect myself from personal liability. Because, you know, legal shit. Um, I just, I, there's a lot of things that I want to do that I could, that, that, that I have the potential to be paid for. And if I can turn that into somewhat of a business and potentially hire people on at some point to do this stuff with me, that would be pretty cool. Um, so... I'm just, I, I'm going, I'm taking it inch by inch. I'm not jumping right into it because that's always a bad idea. I do have a lot of things to consider. But tarmedia.com, or ta not tarmedia.com, sorry, tarmedia.net. If you go to tarmedia.net, um, that's our website because I couldn't get .com. Uh, if I want to get .com, I, I can, but I have to go through one of these shady websites that's, you know when you search up a domain that doesn't exist anymore and it brings up like a list of top 10 dildos on wish.com, you know, stuff like that. It's like, those stupid lists i'd have to buy it through one of those and i don't i don't know how that kind of stuff goes um so i i, I don't know if i want to touch that i will look into it i will look into getting dot com because i know it's going to be simpler but dot net worked i paid 20 bucks for the domain on squarespace it's like it's fine so um tarmedia.net if you go to that website it's a little wonky right now it's in its primordial stages it's not really fully developed yet um but looking forward to it i'm looking forward to what i can build out of it the mobile experience is glitchy um, the first thing you see for some reason is like a picture of my face like it's my self-portrait It shouldn't be there. I'll have to contact Squarespace and figure out why that is It's only supposed to be there when you tap so like each of the individual elements on the website So on the home page, you're literally greeted by the logo You're greeted by um, social media uh, links and you're greeted by three words and as you mouse over each word It shows you a picture relevant to the word that you moused over so I have music I have videos and I have photography So obviously that just shows you the different aspects of the things that I do um uh, there are the, the three different things that I primarily do. Um, that's about it. And then the, the, the picture slides over as you mouse over it. It's, it's very nice. It's very nice. But on mobile, it's kind of wonky and it doesn't look great. And for some reason, the text is white. And it's not letting me change that. Even when I go into CSS, I still am learning a lot about CSS. I'm not a coder. I don't code. I hate that shit. I hate dealing with software. I will be the first to admit that. I don't like dealing with software. I think dealing with software is a pain in the ass. I like dealing with hardware. I don't like dealing with pain in the ass software. I hate it. I, coding is not for me. I try doing that kind of stuff and it's just, it's, it's too much. Like I can handle it. I can do it. I'm capable of it, but I just don't care. Uh, I don't care to do it. It's just not something that I'm in, that I, that I enjoy doing. So that's why I went through Squarespace. I'm just like, I, I could just make a website, but on my own and code it, but I don't feel like it. I don't feel like troubleshooting. I don't feel like all of that. So I'm just using Squarespace because it's easy. It's inexpensive enough to host. And it's it's fine. So tarmedia.net, go ahead and have a look. Go ahead and have a look at my photography, music, video sections, and all that. It's a little wonky. Like I said, I'm still working on the website. It's 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 got some bugs, um, but it's otherwise pretty good. It's it's pretty it's pretty alright. It looks pretty decent. 
um, and it at least gives you a sort of a representation of where we're going to be going in the future. So, yeah, that's about all I have. New camera, console overviews on the way, um, and new website. So, those are my updates. So, yeah. yeah, I will see you guys in the next one, which isn't going to be the console overview. I do actually have a few videos planned. Um, in between now and then because it's going to be a little bit it's probably going to be about a month month and a half maybe even two months because those videos take a lot to produce and it's just me it's just me producing those no one else is involved in the production of these except for the people that you know um have the footage uh, obviously i credit i always i always make sure to credit in like the bottom lower third of the camera uh, or of the frame rather sorry Blah. um just to I, I like i give the channel name and say go to their channel check out the video and all that um i've gotten stuff like that for the console overview as far as footage is concerned but that's about it Anyways, kind of going on a bunch of different digressions at once. But yeah, um, the video is coming. You will be seeing some more videos on the channel um, very soon. Um, I do have some plans for some stuff because I just kind of want to get off my ass and do something. I've just been kind of tired and lazy lately. So yeah, you'll be seeing me soon. And I'll be seeing you soon. So, yep. See you in the next one.